Hello everybody and welcome to Tactical Expressions. Today we're going to show you how to replace trigger guard on your AR-15. On our website you're going to find a huge amount of different trigger guards, different colors, different engravings, and we even do a custom made. You can really take customization of your AR-15 to the next level. When you order a trigger guard from us, uh, you're going to receive all the hardware installation, Allen wrench tool, screw, and roll pin. Now let's go ahead and install uh, this cool looking trigger guard. First go ahead and make sure your chamber is clear. Go ahead and separate your upper receiver uh, with the lower. On your standard military spec AR-15, your trigger guard secure in two places. One is gonna be your roll pin, which you have to knock it out. And with a quick release, uh, last pin is actually really uh, easy to uh, remove by just pressing on the spring-loaded pin. But before uh, doing that, we actually have to remove this roll pin first. You have some risk of breakage while removing trigger guard and by just simply breaking this little uh, ear. So you need to make sure you support them really good. You can either use the little uh, wound block uh, with a hole and uh, secure your lower lip or to use bench block, which we're gonna be uh, using it today. Use a roll pin punch uh, to remove this pin, and I'm currently using a 3 a 32. If you don't have a measurements on your punches, just find something that will perfectly fit on the roll pin. It's not gonna be too small or too big. And just simply uh, knock your uh, pin out. Go slowly and periodically check uh, if there is any changes on your pin, if it's uh, continue going out. And uh, our roll pin is out and you can pull your trigger guard out. Push on last roll pin right here and completely remove your uh, trigger guard. Now to install your uh, new uh, trigger guard by Tactical uh, Expressions, uh, I recommend you to install the front first. Uh, it will lock the trigger in place a little bit better. And I'm gonna be using this red one just for a better transition so you can see it better on the video. So just grab your uh, screw that uh, comes in a package. You can pre-loop your screw so it will go easier. I already uh, did this. And just simply screw down with the Allen wrench that is also provided in the kit. Now uh, you're ready to install the roll pin, so just be extremely carefully uh, while you're doing it. Grab your uh, roll pin and uh, you have to lubricate just uh, so it can go easier. Uh, it's not it's not really good if it's gonna go on dry and actually uh, do damage uh, something. And it's gonna take also a longer uh, to do it. Now I have a, a starter punch. I highly recommend you to get really cool uh, tool to have uh, instead of just having a, a flat punch like this all rounded can actually ruin your installation highly recommend you to get this starter punch so go ahead insert in it and just simply knock the new uh, roll pin in Now we're gonna finish the installation of the roll pin, which is the regular uh, flat head punch. All 
All right, trigger guard installation complete. And now you have a really cool uh, looking trigger guard by Tactical Expressions.